Hey everybody, it, this is an update on the Gemma twin kits and the boy is officially finished. He is born right now. Um, I'm just putting him on the scale. He's about five pounds. So yeah, that is him. Congratulations to your boy. I consider this one the boy. I think it looks more like the boy, even though they are the same kits. Um, I think he looks like a Zachariah. I have no clue what you are considering for names, but I think it looks like a Zachariah. There's his details. I had brown eyelashes. I put brown eyelashes on. We'll rooted them in. Put gloss in the eyes, nose, and mouth. That's just the detail. Full focus. And his stork bite. And the girl does have a stork bite because they are newborn. So they have more modeling stuff. So she has it over on the side of her head. So it's not in like the same place or anything. Here's all of his beautiful modeling. Oop, don't fall off. Here, I should put him down. Hold on. There, put you on the bed. Here's his beautiful modeling. His inner arms here. And his veins somewhere, wherever I put them. Um, you can see the veins right there. It's kind of hard to tell um, detail on videos, but they ha she he has um, tipped and sealed nails. Little red palms. And I love how I did the dark modeling right here because that's what babies have. I've just recently got to hold um, newborn twins, which was convenient, but I saw their modeling on their hands and it was like just like that, and I love how I did that. It makes it look so realistic. There's this other hand, so you can see the modeling right there. Tipped and sealed nails. Here's the tipped and sealed nails. Tipped and sealed nails. Little red knees. Beautiful modeling. The little feet. I love how I did the feet on these ones. They're so cute. The red and the little red toesies. Little red toesies. So, yeah, that is him. I'll show you inside the ears. I did awesome veining on the ears. I love how I did it. If you can see that, my camera isn't that good, but. You can see the red veins I did on there. It's just awesome. I love the detail on this one. So yeah, the girl will be done soon um, on Monday. But yeah, that is him. I have to tell you about the um, matte varnish. It's like a matte varnish you put on the babies that so you don't they don't get shiny, and it seals the paint a lot better, so the paint doesn't like rub off ever rub off after a while. Um, it does have a textured feeling and um, which makes it like actually pretty cool. Some people like it, some people don't. But it has textured and you can kind of see the texture too. But um, if, if you don't like it, it will rub off after a while. Like after you change him quite a few times, then it will rub off. It's just that um, it feels a little rough kind of in like patches and stuff but after a while it'll rub off as I said um you can feel it after you touch it like chalky feeling but I just do that because otherwise they'll be shiny and it's just really unrealistic when they're super shiny and stuff like that so yeah he'll be a little bit like rough but as I said it'll just rub off and everything it does give it a realistic um kind of textury white like baby flaky skin so yeah, just need to tell you about that, just so you don't freak out, because it's like, kind of rough and everything. But, yeah, there they are. Um, I will probably dress him, and then, yeah, maybe take...
do a photo shot video because photo shoot video because I can't take pictures and put them into videos so I'll probably just make a video saying like here's some pictures and stuff so yeah keep updated for his photo shoot and I'll have the girl done on Monday thanks for watching bye